Three years ago, TV personality and chef Rachel Ray achieved a lifelong aspiration when she and her husband John purchased a home in one of their favorite places on earth, Italy. Rachel said, One of my earliest memories is my grandpa sharing stories about Italy, the mountains, and how people would farm all the way up to the sky. All my life, I've always wanted to live in Italy. They actually bought a house on Italian land without running water or electricity. But that wasn't a problem. It's in Tuscany where the couple got Got married, which was enough to convince Rachel. John, however, needed a bit more persuasion. Come 2022, the pair ended up completing their property makeover and turning their Italy property into a dream home. On another note, Rachel's New York City apartment and her upstate New York home had been impacted by natural disasters over the last few years. Her apartment being devastated by Hurricane Ida and her upstate residence was destroyed in a chimney fire. Rachel Ray, a household name in the culinary world, was born on August 25th, 1968 in Glens Falls, New York. Rachel grew up in a family who worked in the food industry with her mother managing restaurants in upstate New York, instilling in Rachel a love for cooking from an early age. Rachel's rise to fame began with her innovative concept of 30-minute meals, which she debuted on local TV. Her ability to create delicious, accessible meals quickly resonated with viewers, eventually leading to her own show on the Food Network. This success was followed by multiple TV shows, including Rachel Ray's Tasty Travels, Inside Dish, and her daytime talk show, The Rachel Ray Show, won multiple daytime Emmy awards. Beyond TV, Rachel has authored numerous cookbooks, launched a magazine called Every Day with Rachel Ray, and developed a line of cookware and pet food. In her personal life, Rachel found love with John Cusimano, an attorney and lead singer of the rock band The Cringe. The couple married in Tuscany, Italy in 2005, a place that holds special significance for them. The couple owns a stylish apartment in New York City and a rustic charming home in Lake Luzerne, upstate New York. Their Lake Luzerne home, nestled in the serene Adirondack Mountains, was a sanctuary that they cherished deeply. Tragically, it was destroyed in a chimney fire in 2020, a significant loss for the couple. But despite this setback, Rachel's resilience shone through as she shared the rebuilding process with her fans, turning this tragedy into an opportunity for a fresh start. Rachel and John also realized a lifelong dream by purchasing a house in Tuscany, Italy, which we'll check out first. A few years back, Rachel and her husband checked off one of their life goals when they bought a property in Italy. Rachel said about this, when I was a very small girl, one of my earliest memories is my grandpa telling me stories about Italy, the mountains, and how people would farm all the way up to the sky. All my life, all I ever wanted was to live in Italy. To be exact, they bought a house on Italian soil with no running water or electricity. This wasn't an issue for Rachel as the property is in Tuscany where they got married. This made the whole thing irresistible to her. Her, but her husband needed some convincing. He said, I was not impressed. It was basically a pile of rubble. I said, honey, I'm pretty sure we drove by about five villas that are done. They have tennis courts. They have swimming pools. They're built and they have for sale signs on them. Why don't we just buy one of those? and move in tomorrow. But the land was so beautiful, with a vineyard even. So the couple purchased it and they got to work creating their dream Italy property. Rachel opened up the doors to viewers for a tour and were able to see how beautiful it really is. There's a reception area walking into Rachel's Italy home where guests can grab a coffee or drink at the beverage station. And there's even a cabinet full of toiletries and other necessities. John has his own piano or music room, which is stunning with its walls of glass. Rachel and John also show the guest apartment within their home, which is actually where they spend most of their time, saying it's all the space that the couple and their dog needs. Rachel explained, When John and I are here alone, this is the only part of the house we need to open up, really. We can leave the rest of the house dark and we don't have to keep it going. The main home has a large open living area and kitchen, which Rachel no doubt utilizes plenty. There are also details like a pizza oven, and also on the tour, Rachel shows off their 
their stylish master suite. Meanwhile, on the tour, Rach tells behind the scenes stories about special artwork and furniture from friends, such as a table that features photos of Rach's notebooks that burned in her 2020 New York house fire. Outside is where you'll find more luxury highlights like the couple's grill, bocce ball court, garden, and swimming pool, which their dog Bella loves. And we can't forget the stunning view. Rachel also has a stunning home in upstate New York, but believe it or not, a few years ago that home burned down. She and her husband were lucky enough to live in their guest house next door while the main home was being rebuilt so she could continue filming her show. Rachel gave a look at her newly rebuilt home a year after it was destroyed in the fire. Following the blaze, all that remained of the house was quote unquote just a hole in the ground, according to Rachel. While they rebuilt things mostly the same as it looked like before, there were some small tweaks with the renovations, like removing skylights in the bottom guest room and changing the roof from wood to tin. Despite being newly built, the house maintains its homey, lived-in feel thanks to the largely wood-covered interior. After the fire, Ray and her husband lost most of their adult lives, she said, and later added that she's grateful to have been able to rebuild their home so quickly. Rachel previously opened up about escaping the fire on the season 15 premiere of her show last year, telling viewers that she and her husband were about to enjoy dinner together when a man ran into their yard to tell them their roof was on fire. Throughout her career and personal life, Rachel Ray has demonstrated an unwavering commitment to her passions and loved ones. Her journey from a small town girl with a love for cooking to a global culinary icon is an inspiring tale of hard work, determination, and resilience. Whether she's whipping up a 30 minute meal, rebuilding her home, or enjoying the Tuscan countryside with John, Rachel continues to embody a zest for life that inspires millions around the world. That'll wrap up today's house tour. Thank you all for watching, and don't forget to hit subscribe if you haven't yet. I'm Care the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.